Hello everyone, I'm Maya and welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm just going to be chilling and chit-chatting with you guys and doing a little life update. I feel like this video is very much needed because I was on and off YouTube for a while and then now I'm back, but you guys still don't really know what's going on in my life, so I thought I would share everything with you guys today. But before we get into it, make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe. Binge me after you're done with this video and don't forget to watch those ads because that is how your girly gets paid. And let's go ahead and get right on in with the video. So on my community tab, I asked you guys to send me in questions. And of course, I'm going to be getting into those in this video. But I wanted to first off just like talk about what's been going on in my life, what you guys haven't seen. And I just wanted to give you guys the rundown on what's been going on in my life recently. So starting off with the category of school. I really don't like school, but unfortunately, it does take up a big portion of my life. So I thought I would talk about that first. Real ones know that I go to an art school and I have eight classes total. Four of those being arts classes and four of those being academic classes and let me tell you guys school has been very hectic recently we just came back to school from spring break about like two or three weeks ago and now it is crunch time because we are closing off the school year i'm really happy about that but that does mean that it is testing season we have to get all of our like eocs and final exams and all those testing things done so that we can like graduate and move on to like the next school year i think you guys know how most of that stuff works i have been having so many exams i've been studying a lot doing a lot of assignments and for some of my classes we have finals coming up and we haven't even covered all the material yet so when i tell you guys it is crunch time it is crunch time Overall though, it hasn't been too bad. It just hasn't been leaving me with a whole lot of time for YouTube and other things that I've been wanting to spend my time doing. School comes first though, so I have been doing my best to prioritize that first and getting as much schoolwork as I can done and then I can like move on to like what I want to spend my time doing. I think I'm pretty good at like managing my time and I think I've been like pretty successful with that, you know? Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to talk about when it comes to school. So we're going to go ahead and move on to the next category, which is going to be sports. You guys may or may have not known that a year ago, I joined a competitive rock climbing team. I went rock climbing for the first time when I was in elementary school. And then in middle school, I started to climb a lot more frequently. And then I decided to try out for the team and I gladly made it on. And I had a really good year on team. One year of climbing is split into two different seasons, which are boulder and rope climbing. And it was really good. I have like I don't want to like come on here and just complain and rant about like the things I liked versus what I didn't like on team but long long story short though I quit team I still am rock climbing I have a membership and I try and go every single week but team just really wasn't for me I love my teammates so so much and I still kind of feel like I am a team kid even though I'm really not on team anymore but it just wasn't what I was wanting to do so if you guys were wondering how rock climbing was going it's going good, I'm just not on the team anymore. I am really happy with my decision. I sat and I talked with my parents for a while and we just came to the conclusion that being on team just really wasn't what I wanted to do and it does take up a lot of time with practices and comps and things. So you're either in it to win it or you're not and I really wasn't. Other than rock climbing, I guess I have like two other main things that make up my life which would be YouTube and social media as well as just like friends and family and just like the things that you guys don't see but I don't know how I'm gonna talk about that stuff so we're just gonna go ahead and talk about YouTube. When it comes to YouTube, it's kind of been a roller coaster. Back in December, I was doing Vlogmas and I unfortunately didn't complete Vlogmas. I'm really sad about that because I wanted to post every single day but was not getting enough sleep. I did not have enough time to produce the videos that I wanted and I was just uploading random things and I really was not putting my best foot forward when it came to it. So I'm thinking for this year's Vlogmas, I might do like weekly Vlogmas or just upload like I normally have been and just not do Vlogmas at all. Um, after I wasn't doing Vlogmas, I was just posting like randomly. I'm still kind of doing that now, but I'm trying to post a little bit more consistently than I was. I was going like a month without posting and then I would show one video and I'd be like, yeah guys, I'm getting back into YouTube, you know how it is, and then I'll be gone for a couple more weeks and I'll post again and then it'll be like this same thing that was going on and this pattern that I didn't like that I was starting to create for myself. So now I am trying to get on a weekly posting schedule. I still haven't gotten there yet, but I am trying to not go 
10 billion weeks without posting i do want to thank you guys so so much for the support and my youtube journey even though it's been all over the place i do love making videos so so much and when summer comes i promise you guys i will actually be posting because how could i not post during summer like then i have no excuse the excuse would be that i was lazy because i could not blame it on school i can't blame it on climbing because i'm not on team like there's nothing else to blame it on now that you guys got that little ramble sesh that i don't know if you guys even wanted i'm going to be answering some of your really random questions that you guys asked me on my community tab i didn't really give you guys much context i just said send in questions so you guys did and i'm going to be attempting to answer those today i didn't get like a super super crazy amount but i got some so let's just go ahead and start answering them have you had your first kiss yet and that would be no i've never had a first kiss i've never had a boyfriend a relationship a situationship nothing so i have no tea on that for you guys what is your current favorite song my favorite song changes within like every few weeks because i find a song that i really like and then i play it way too much that i get tired of it but right now my favorite song is puppet by tyler the creator i think it's just a really good song and my friend addison put me onto it and i'm just so very happy that she did what is your advice for dealing with mean girls i have so much i could say about this as most of us know mean girls and mean people in general are just putting their insecurities onto you they're insecure of themselves and don't know what to do other than make other people feel bad about themselves so that you guys are on an equal level and if the mean girl is your friend meaning that like y'all were friends and then she started being mean you need to cut that girl off because she's not bringing you any happiness or joy and if your friends aren't bringing that to you you shouldn't be friends but on the other hand if this mean girl is someone that like you're not friends with you don't know her she's just being mean to you you need you can you can try and address it yourself talk to her tell her that this isn't okay and if she's not listening and is continuing to hurt you and make you feel bad you need to talk to an adult whether this is a teacher a counselor a parent a principal if need be but you need to get other people involved because your happiness is on the line i want you guys to be as happy and as joyful as possible and enjoy your school experience and if this girl is hurting that then something needs to be done what is a movie that you could watch every day to all the boys i've loved before specifically the third movie but i really like all of the movies how has your freshman year of high school been going i have met so many amazing funny loving people that i can now call my friends i've loved all the memories that i've made this year with those people and yes i'm gonna miss them over the summer but i am still happy that it's almost done but overall i think freshman year has been a pretty good year for me and it's probably been one of my best school years yet to be honest other than like elementary school because elementary school was top tier who is your favorite disney character mm, my favorite disney character would probably be princess tiana i love her so so much and then i think this is considered a pixar movie but i really love mike wazowski you guys probably didn't know this about me but i love monsters inc so so much and mike wazowski is just a pretty cool guy what is your favorite place to be i honestly don't know like i love so many different places like i love being with my family if you consider that a place but i love going to the beach i love being in downtown i love traveling i love doing a whole lot of different things so i don't know if i have a specific place that i really like but you know planet earth is pretty cool do you have a boyfriend no what is your biggest goal this year my biggest goal this year is probably just to be as happy as i can and just to do what i love favorite skincare product the cerave moisturizing cream it's such a good product and i love it so so much favorite youtubers my favorite youtubers would be Aaliyah simone as leah williams um jordan vlogs Nicole Leno and probably Lyric Walker but she doesn't really post on that channel anymore she mainly posts on Lyric Reads so I love Lyric Reads yeah you guys that was basically the video life update the chit chat the ramble vlog that you guys didn't ask for but I love you guys and I'll see you guys very soon back with another video